A boat abandoned after crashing into the rocks at Alabama Point. Now people there want to know who's responsible and why the vessel was just left there. WKRD News 5's Taylor Boyson has details from Orange Beach. I mean, this right here is not something you see every day at the beach, but for some locals down here, it's not that strange. The things that you see out here, it really isn't surprising. Dylan Mitchell and his fiance Caitlin Argo say Monday was a typical beach day for the two. That was until Caitlin stumbled upon the boat walking down the beach. Definitely something that I wasn't expecting to stumble across on a day just strolling the beach. The two moved here a few months ago, and Caitlin says she's never seen anything like it. I was wondering how it got there, you know, what situation led up to this moment and uh, kind of was wondering why everybody was just acting like it wasn't there. I seem to be the only person confused. But for her fiance who grew up around boats says he's not surprised at all. I wouldn't say an everyday type of thing, but definitely more common than it should be. Dylan says he's seen plenty of boat wrecks since he's lived here, especially when people try to drive across the jetty rocks, not knowing how shallow it is. It did make it quite a bit farther up on the rocks, caused a little bit more damage. Most of the time people end up on the sand or just at the bottom of the rocks and usually can be recovered same day. This one he did manage to go above and beyond. Officials with the Alabama Law Enforcement Agency say that they're continuing to investigate the wreck and will keep us updated with the latest. In Orange Beach, Taylor Boyson, WKRG News 5.